Alright guys, this is going to be a quick video on how to use the World of Warcraft group finding add-on called OQ. Start, go to Google, and type in OQ download, and then click on the Solid Ice link. It should be the first thing that comes up. I'll also add a link in the description. This is what the web page looks like. Click on OQ, and then once you're here, click download now. It takes a couple seconds to download, and then once you do, Let's see here. Do, do, do. Show in folder. OQ9. This is the latest version. There might be a more recent one by the time you get it. And then go to World of Warcraft, interface, add ons, and paste it there. If you're um, if your World of Warcraft client is running, you're gonna need to restart your game and then it'll show up. If it doesn't show up, just reinstall it. Sometimes that happens with add-ons. And now let's go in game and see how the add-on worked. All right guys, so now that we're in game, uh, we're gonna pop open OQ and this is what it's gonna look like. Uh, usually when you first open it, it's gonna be jumping down as all the groups are added. Uh, I think they're sorted like alphabetically um, by numbers first and then letters, which is why people do these exclamation points. But that's really not necessary because there's a search function, which is this little glass ball up here. So you can see I'm running a Celestials group right now. So Celestials, Flex, Twos, Threes, uh, Firelands, you know, you name it, ICC, you name it, it's up there, you can find a group for it. Um, so yeah, let's get into it. To create a pre-made, this is the tab you come into, pre-made name, have to have that pre-made type this is mandatory world bosses I just do miscellaneous um, since most people use the first search function it's really not that important uh, you can also search by this little drop-down box and you can see 65 arena groups 69 raids blah 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 um, if right when you log in you're having trouble with the list moving on you as more groups are loaded you can click the pause button right here and that'll freeze it where it is and you'll be able to click um, when you first install OQ, oh, when, you, when you first install OQ, this little box right here, qualified, is going to be unchecked. Um, and you can see here, oh, uh, if I try to join, I have about a 550 eye level. So if I try to join, it says boom, not qualified. So it won't even let you join the waitlist. So you should just always keep qualified checked. Um, and then I had to disband my pre-made group, so create pre-made, get it going up again. Uh, right here on your mini-map, uh, you can see there's this little banner right to the bottom left, southwest of the OQ side. And that is telling you how many people are on your waitlist. So right now, I have nobody on my waitlist. It says zero, one person join, boom. Click to invite them. This is an invite all button. Um, remove offline that's in case if you're in like a flex group and you guys have started and somebody leaves about halfway whoop, somebody leaves about halfway through there'll probably be some people on your wait list who have been there for over an hour so clicking remove offline will just save you the hassle of trying to invite people who aren't online um, so that looks like we miss this battleground but that's okay um, so yeah, coming into the settings, everything is pretty much set up uh, as you want it right now. Say sapped, who popped lust, announced killing blows. You know, this is just pretty pretty useful stuff. Auto set roll. Uh, the only thing is announced contracts. Uh, Tiny implemented contracts to encourage people to leave the cities. And basically it just selects a random NPC for people to go kill. And it counts towards the score. So now looking at the scoreboard, um, Killing bosses, winning games, leading groups, get your points on the scoreboard. So, looking at it right now, my favorite part about it, I don't really care about the stuff on the right, but over here on the left, I always think it's cool to look and see who's winning the battlegrounds. So right now you can see the Horde are winning Strand of Ancients, they pretty much always do. Alliance are winning Isle of Conquest, like they pretty much always do. But up here, everything else is about 50-50, but right here, Alterac Valley is swung way over to Horde which probably means that there's a group in there farming HKs. So if you're Alliance right now, you don't want to be queuing into All Direct Valley because you're just going to get farmed, um, which isn't fun. So yeah, 
Let's see, pre-made type, you can do roll checks, ready checks, um, I don't know what Lucky Charms does, BRB, you know, you can just type in the chat if that's what you want to do. Um, let's see, ban list, uh, I guess sometimes people ban, a lot of times people advertise their Twitch in here, Twitch, Wolfie, I don't know, whatever, lame. Uh, don't advertise your Twitch, that's, nobody's going to look at it, so don't even bother. Um, so yeah, the only other thing I'd say is if you're looking for something and it isn't here, you can click Find Mesh and, you know, who knows, it'll try to connect you with a couple other people. Um, if you're trying to get more people on your wait list, Finding Mesh, maybe we'll get a couple more. Um, but, you know, you just have to be patient and people will join if they want to. Um, yeah. I guess just looking at this, you can see their rating. This is PvP rating in like arenas, Brazil, PvP power, eye level. Uh, this is class color and then their spec, so you can see if they're a healer or a tank just by, you know, I mean, you have to know their, the uh, spec symbol, but. So yeah, guys, uh, if you have any questions, you can let me know, but I am not the author of this add-on and I do not really support it, but I'll try to answer any questions you have down in the comments. So yeah, I hope you find your group, and thanks for watching. Get your fat loots.